This is Dr. Timothy Lineski with Lake Cumberland Rheumatology uh, bringing another video to you today. Uh, I'm currently uh, driving back from our London office with uh, two of our employees who we wish to remain out of the camera. In the back you will see a uh, four-wheeler. We're out uh, this Labor Day with the kids having a fun time. Today I want to talk to you about um, Visco supplements. Visco supplements are injections in the knee that we do to try to help people with knee pain from osteoarthritis. There are a few different products that we give. Uh, at our office, we generally will use two products. One is called OrthoVisc, and the other one is called Hyalgin. These are a series of injections, one week apart, uh, usually uh, between three to five injections. Now anytime you do these type of products, uh, no matter which one, you want to do it in accordance with a multidiscipline plan. You want to be doing the uh, physical therapy exercises that we uh, give patients in their handouts whenever we talk about these medicines. And also anytime you have uh, arthritis of the knee, weight loss is important. 15 pounds of weight loss in clinical trials was shown to uh, reveal uh, a significant amount of pain uh, reduction. So in general, what are these Visco supplements? Essentially, when you have an arthritis in your knee, you have the cartilage breaking down. That cartilage produces pressure on the bone and causes bone marrow swelling, and your body's natural response to that is to grow more bone, and that is what we call a bone spur. As this cartilage degrades, um, it uh, becomes increased uh, with stiffness, and the thoughts are is that there is a lack of production of the natural supplement called hyaluronic acid. And that's what these are. They basically are a replacement of the natural product that you're supposed to have in your knees. Now the interesting thing with them is, is that the uh, length and how long they work are that you do an injection or a series of injections and it's supposed to last for six months. Our average patients actually have knee pain that lasts longer than that. And a question that's always given up to me, or given to me, is said, uh, uh, Dr. Lineski, you know, uh, how do I know these are going to work for me? I'm bone on bone, or, uh, you know, I've been told I need knee replacements. As a general rule, I don't tell people, oh, because you're this bad with your arthritis, these medicines aren't going to work for you. There are cases where people have bad, had severe severe disease, uh, you know, a 75-year-old patient who has multiple medical problems and can't have knee replacements, and we've done these injections, and they've worked very, very nicely for them. Obviously, the younger you are and the less arthritis, the more likely you're going to have a dramatic response. Um, so we do our injections, and I encourage you, if you do these injections through anybody else, they should be under uh, a guidance, either ultrasound like we do, or some people do it under fluoroscopy too. Uh, either way, uh, you want to make sure that you put this uh, thick substance, substance into your knee because if you get it outside, that's when people have reactions called pseudosepsis. It basically causes a lot of redness and erythema, and you can understand why. This is big, thick gel, and if you don't get it inside the knee, your body's going to react to it more likely. So, uh, in conclusion, uh, visco supplements are something that you can utilize to help with osteoarthritis of the knee. Uh, we have posted a video previously of a knee injection that you could see, and um, we, uh, we do them every day at uh, Lake Cumberland and uh, have had a significant amount of success for it, with it. So check out that video, and if you have any questions, uh, give me a post. I've enjoyed uh, talking to all you guys and answering all your questions out there. Uh, keep them coming. Have a great day.